Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Can we just take a moment to appreciate my t-shirt? says, be kind. I got this from the recent Vegan Nights event in London. It's by a brand called Self Care Company. I absolutely love it. I'll leave a link down below as well where you can go and check them out and everything. But today's video is going to be another kind of food haul. I absolutely love doing these for you. I love seeing new companies and new like supermarkets and stuff, like bring out loads of different products and everything and just give a lot more option to vegans and people who want to try vegan food and stuff but today's video is going to be about a huge huge box which is the vegan nutrition store this is a plant based food um, and vegan online supermarket it's kind of like the vegan supermarket but these are I feel like they're a lot more money friendly they have like different hampers you can buy which actually has tons of food i have one of the hampers with me as well today to show you guys um and they just have tons and tons of different products they are expanding quite a lot and a lot of the food that they do have is made by them or uh, they also stock like other brands and stuff that which i'm going to show you but a lot of the food that i'm going to show you is frozen stuff so we have recently bought a new freezer um, in which we can put all of this stuff in and everything. Um, so yeah, a lot of this stuff is gonna last me such a, such a, such a long time. Um, I can't wait to try it. And yeah, instead of me just rambling, I'm gonna show you what I got. So I'm gonna start off with the stuff that's actually in the hamper that you can buy. Um, the hamper retails for $49.99. There are different ones you can get. You can get one that's solely based on, which is a smaller one on like temper and like the meats and stuff or you can get a, another one which has a wider range of products um, and you just get absolutely tons like I'm not going to be struggling for food anytime soon but the hamper includes two packs of sausages which can contain so many sausages so I've got these two packs here this one is a is 16 apple and sage flavor sausages and then this one is the meat-free breakfast sausage um, and I just can't believe how many sausages are in these packs. You get absolutely tons that do, do look really, really delicious. Um, I apologise if they look a bit wet. They have been out of the freezer for a little bit. Um, but these are stored frozen, which I think is really, really handy because I always find a lot of sausages you either have to store in the fridge or you don't really get big packs of them. These are going to last me absolutely ages. I'm more excited to try the apple and sage flavour sausages, I think, over the breakfast ones just because I really like flavoured sausages and I really like the packaging of this. It looks really kind of like simple eco-friendly and it's just it's not over the top like it's not really like really gimmicky or over the top packaging and I just can't wait to try these these are basically just made out of mushrooms water wheat rust wheat rusk rolled oats vegetable oil potato starch dried apple pieces sea salt sugar herbs and spices um and it's just they sound really, really good. I don't think I've had any sausages that have actually been made from mushrooms before. Both of these are made from mushrooms, but I'm really, really excited to try these. I've only really tried like soya um, sausages and like temper sausages. So I'm really, really excited to try these. Then in the hamper, you also get some of the Dr. Zach's high protein bread. Again, this was frozen. However, I have let it um, defrost overnight because I really, really wanted to try this. This has 30 grams of protein per two slices, 30% less to carbohydrates, and I think this is just going to be really, really delicious. I love like brown bread, uh, like wholemeal bread and everything, and I like the fact that it is labelled vegan because I know a lot of... Um, a lot of breads can include stuff um, that is kind of hidden that you don't really know of, um, but I'm definitely excited to try bread. So I got a lot of temper, like, and I mean a lot. This hamper contains so much temper. I got some of barbecue temper, I got sweet and sour, I got a original, and then I did also get another three blocks of huge original temper as well now, these are labeled as pores however they are actually made um by the company uh vegan nutrition store so they do have um they will be changing it to their own branding very soon but these just are really delicious they're just these slices and i think these would be really really good in like a sandwich or like a wrap or something or even for like breakfast as like a bacon substitute or something i think i'm most excited for the sweet and sour and the barbecue flavor just because i think they're going to be absolutely delicious i've tried the 
um, like the smoky bacon one from a different company before and I really really like it. So odd texture to get used to just because it's made from like soybeans and that sort of texture is kind of a bit odd but I think if you're looking for a kind of like a meat substitute then you'll really really get on with these. I'm excited to try the original one as well just because it's going to be nice trying to flavour it and bring it to my own taste as well. And having three Bloxies, I think I'm going to give one of these to my friends as well to see what they think of it as well. Um, but I think this just has so much choice. Like this hamper is so, so, so big. In the hamper as well, you also do get a ton and ton of burgers. Um, so I got some of the chicken style burgers and then you also get some traditional burgers. You also then get two packs of the schnitzels. I love this brand fries. When I ordered the hamper, I didn't expect it to be this company, um, which I'm really, really like, I'm kind of happy about that because I love fries stuff and I know it's really, really good. Um, I mean, I've never tried either of these before, um, but I'm really excited to try the chicken style burgers. Anything that represents chicken is just going to be amazing um and then the traditional burgers i recently tried the asda traditional kind of beef style burgers and i really really like them i know a lot of people have said they're not really that flavorsome but i don't know if they've changed them in any way or anything because i actually really really like them i'm surprised by how much i did like them so i will see how these um compare to them they're a lot quicker in cooking you only have to cook them in eight minutes and you only get four in this the um, as to one you get eight in which I think is very very good value um, but these might be a bit thicker and just a bit more like juicy. I also have never tried these schnitzels um, these are soya and flaxseed um, they do look really really good um, they are vegan non-gm product no hormones or antibiotics high in iron and omega-3 fatty acids I've never really tried any schnitzels before they just never really called to me but the the uh, coating on this looks really crunchy and really like kind of like southern fried chicken. I really, really like the texture of that. So I'm excited to try some of these and I got two packs of them. So I better, better like them. Then in the hamper as well, we got two pizzas. The first pizza we got was the sourdough margarita pizza. Anything pizza, anything just, you know, like cheese and I'm game for it. The other pizza I got was the Mediterranean vegetable one. I'll open one of these up to show you what they are like. I really, really like the look of them. I think they look absolutely delicious. Um, it looks very kind of like tomato-y um, and kind of like a more sophisticated margarita. Usually I see margaritas and it's just like tomato sauce and a bit of cheese lobbed on top, but these look really delicious. They look like they've been spiced really well and you get a good amount of cheese as well. I'll be interested to see what the cheese is like on these just because I know some cheeses don't exactly like melt very much so it'll be interesting to see how they hold up. Then in that you also got a cheesy garlic bread which I think is the thing I'm most excited for. I love garlic bread. I like a good garlic bread. I think my favourite has to be the one from Zizi, the vegan garlic bread from Zizi. Nothing can top that so we'll see how this one compares to the one from Zizi but I have high hopes for it. It looks, I have opened this up um, and I'll open it up to show you as well but it looks very very good and very garlicky and delicious. I'm just so glad that they haven't skimped out on cheese on this and for the money I think you get so much in this hamper. Now there is two things left that you get in the hamper and that is two blocks of tofu. Now on the website um, I saw that it was just a picture two blocks of tofu. I didn't expect it to come through as these two um, uh, tofu blocks. Now I've tried this brand before and I'm not I'm not 100% like a huge fan of this brand. I find that it's not as firm as some of the other tofus that I've tried but I am going to try it again and see what it's like. It is a silken and smooth organic tofu um, and I'm just, I'm just intrigued to see whether or not the previous then one I tried was just a bit kind of like a bit of a miss but we'll see again with these two. So that was everything you could get in the hamper. I can't believe how much you get in that. Um, it's definitely worth the money you spend on it. But there was a few other things that I got um, that I'm going to show you and um, I'm really, really excited for them. So the first thing I got was another fries product and this is some meat-free chicken style nuggets. I've had these before. My boyfriend loves these. I think these are his like most favourite chicken nuggets apart from some of the corn southern fried bites. He loves these. He loves the texture of these. He loves how 
like the flavour of them is really really like chicken but not too much that it's going to put you off but these are delicious I think everyone should try these and give them a go fries really knocked it out of the park with this with their like their crumbs on them and they really kind of like flavor up in the oven and stuff then i also got two of their fresh um wellingtons i got the butternut chili and quinoa wellington and then i also got some of the moroccan aubergine wellington these are again you can keep frozen um and then you just bake from frozen as well i'm really excited to try these i love things like wellington puff pastry anything like that and it's delicious i think i'm more excited for the butternut chili one just because i think that sounds absolutely delicious um they do a few other options of these as well especially for easter they always have some like specials going on and stuff um and then but these are just so easy especially to keep them in the freezer as well i think these are going to be absolutely delicious then i got some of this how do you pronounce it like akai 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 uh, raw super, superfood smoothie pack i always like having like some fruit or some veg or like frozen berries and stuff in the freezer because i love this and especially these are going to be great going into summer and like spring um and like the warmer weathers i really like having sort of like a smoothie with some like oats and stuff like they've even pictured it on the front and then with some like fresh fruit on top it's really refreshing really like nutritious this is a source of omega three six and nine and then you get four um sachets of 100 grams inside so i like the fact that they've already pre-measured it out then i also got some sesame seeds sesame seeds i think um are really i just hit myself in the face with this anyway sesame seeds are really good for like on top of tofu like you can have make sesame seed like lemon tofu i think it's really delicious i've seen tons of people uh have that um but i think this is like the cheapest brand that i've seen that does sesame seeds for like a good quality amount a lot of places do like 100 grams for like two pound or like one pound fifty or something but this is 250 grams um and so this is going to last me an, a long long time then i got some of these bare naked noodles these are zero fat low in calories with only 0 0.9 carbohydrates per 100 grams i think i've tried something by this brand before and honestly they stank so much i'm not sure what it is in this um it might be the oatmeal flour or some of the flowers or in it or something but they smell so so bad but i think once you um cook them and then flavor them and stuff they are going to taste a lot like like better they taste a lot better they're a little bit rubbery but i think it's definitely worth it if you don't want to like if you want to have like a healthier meal or something but i'm intrigued to see what these ones are like i can't remember the last the ones that i've tried before but i definitely it definitely wasn't these so i'll see whether these are as rubbery and as flavorless then i got two packs of cauliflower rice i love cauliflower rice i think it's so much better than normal rice um i just love the flavor of this and i love the fact that it's not as like heavy in calories and it's a lot healthier for you um i know a lot of people would just be like just have normal rice and stuff but i honestly prefer the flavor of cauliflower rice and in these bags they're so simple you just whack it in the microwave and it's done in like two and a half minutes and stuff this is slightly more expensive than like traditional normal rice and if you buy like rice dry and stuff it's gonna a lot it's gonna be a lot more cost effective but this is gonna be really really delicious um and I feel like you can have twice as much as this than normal rice so it's a lot more filling and just enjoyable then the last thing i got was some almond breeze i'm not sure if i've tried almond breeze before i've tried so many different milks like soy milks coconut milk oat milk almond milk by so many different companies um but i don't know whether i've tried almond breeze before i know this is kind of like the original very well known brand that you get um, for almond milk but i'm really excited to try this um i'll see how creamy it is and whether it compares well enough with like my um out pro almond milk that i really really love and enjoy but i'll see if this one is any creamier so guys that was everything that i got from the vegan nutrition store um i can't believe how much i got there's so many things and i'm glad a lot of it is freezer based um i mean we've had to buy a freezer to have more space and stuff but i think this is going to be really really good in the long run like i'm gonna have be able to have a lot of food and stuff this is going to last me for so 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 long i will still incorporate like fresh food in my in my diet like 
fresh fruit, fresh um, fresh vegetables and stuff, and I will like cook a lot of stuff. But it's nice to always have something in the freezer, and I think it's just a little bit more cost effective when you have frozen food and you because you don't want the fresh food to always perish. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, please go and check out the Vegan Nutrition Store. I'll leave both of their Instagrams down below in the description, and I'll also leave them on the screen right now. I'll also leave my Instagram as well down there and on the screen as well, so you can go and check that out. I always post about new vegan foods that I've seen and like new releases and everything. So if you want to go and check that out, then go and be give me a follow on Instagram. Thank you so much again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again next time. Bye.